Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. It's time for another handgun showdown where the viewers of this channel decide which manufacturer makes the better handguns. And we've got a good one today. We are going to match up Glock versus Springfield Armory. And I'm really looking forward to this one. But before we do that, let's report the results back from the last handgun showdown where we matched up Walther versus Canik. And it was a great showdown. But in the end, the Walther people came out and Walther took it. Just so many Walther fans out there and, and they've been around a long time and people really feel comfortable with Walther handguns. Canning people came out as well. This was a great one and I really look forward to Glock versus Springfield Armory. So let's get to it. Let's start with Glock and we'll begin right here with the Glock 19. Everybody knows about the Glock 19. It's been around for a while and this is the gun that others are compared to. Compact size with a four inch barrel, 15 round magazines. It has endured so many torture tests. It really is unbelievable. It stood the test of time. People love it. At one point, this was America's favorite carry gun. I'm not sure if it still is because there are so many other choices out there. Glock is making smaller ones, but this one is, is an amazing gun. People love it. It has night sights. This one does, came with standard Glock sights. Five and a half pound trigger. Actually, I measure a little bit heavier than that. And then a very short reset right there. Does have the trigger bar safety in there. People are used to that. You know, it's, it's like if you get a Glock, you, you know exactly what you are getting. And over here, we've got a Glock 21 and 45 ACP full size handgun with a 4.6 inch barrel. Check out that long sight radius. Excess big dot front sight, line of the back, night sights there, and 13 rounds of 45 ACP. Not bad. And then also have an unloaded firearm. Same trigger pull or close to it. Trigger bar safety in there. Looking at just over five and a half pounds. Many people consider this one of the best home defense firearms out there. You know, it does have a, a rail there to put a light, laser, whatever the choice is. But a great home defense handgun that carries 13 rounds of 45 ACP, you know, 14 total with one in the chamber. Solid choice. People love the Glock 21, and I do as well. But over here, we've got the 43X, and people wanted a higher capacity 9mm subcompact gun. And Glock delivered with the 43X. Added front serrations to it. PVD coated slide, they also make them in black, and a standard 10 round magazine, but aftermarket support is strong with Glock, and they're already getting higher capacity magazines, up to 15 in this small little package. Very nice, solid choice, same trigger pull that, or close to it, as the other two, short reset, and you know, being that it's a fairly new model for Glock, you know, the aftermarket support's already out there and people love it. They carry it and they feel confident with it. The reliability of Glock has been there and it will remain so. And they are an extremely popular handgun manufacturer. But now we have Springfield Armory, also known for its reliability and variety. And here's a good indication of that. Let's start here with the new XDM Elite. 4.0. 5-inch barrel. This gun is feature loaded. Magazines that carry 19 rounds. It does have a flared magwell. Excellent full-size feel. It does have a U-notch rear sight, all metal, and a fiber optic front sight. Loaded chamber indicator bar. Striker fire right here. Wider cut slide serrations. A rail and a flat face trigger that breaks just over 5 pounds. An excellent trigger, and at the range, it just shoots so straight. And a soft shooting gun. Big fan of the XDM models, and this XDM Elite 4.5. I find it to be amazing. But over here, we have the Springfield Hellcat, and this really took the CCW world by storm last year when it was introduced. This is the OSP model. They also make the one that is not optic ready. Flat dark earth, but... This gun offers the highest capacity in any gun of its size in the industry. This is the 13 round mag, also comes with a flat 11 round mag, and that is really good for such a subcompact three inch barrel handgun. It does have 
tritium front dot u-notch rear and an excellent trigger front slide serrations that is breaking right at five and a half pounds right there it's extremely reliable i've run all types of ammo through it i've enjoyed it since day one and i think springfield has a real winner there and many people who carry a gun every day agree and uh, it's just an amazing model now speaking of carry guns right here is a 911 and nine millimeter check that out loaded with eight rounds total 19 and a half ounces so if you're a fan of the 1911 this might do it for you right now it has the seven round magazine in there and it also comes with a flat six round magazine single action 1911 feel to it right there it does have ambidextrous thumb safety this is a stainless steel slide with g10 grips and night sights what a nice handgun all around and you know they did a great job with this and they kept the weight down and many people they would pocket carry this in a second so which company do you feel makes the better handgun is it glock or is it springfield armory let me know i'll tally up the votes and report the results back with the next handgun showdown if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe